Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mac, proud owner of Cherry Bomb, and today we are back for part two of pulling parts for the conversion. We're going to go meet up with Ricky, and then we're going to a different junkyard this time, more in his neck of the woods. But let's get on the road. We just arrived at Ricky's house, and I just wanted to show y'all in his driveway, he has five first gen Tacomas. Found a little poor lifeless truck. Got some taillights though, so success where you can find it. <laughs> oh look, Superman edition. Update for y'all, the first yard we went to, no luck, a bunch of like two wheel drive little trucks. But we might go to a second junkyard, so. Stand. We're at a private yard right now, and there's just Toyotas for days. So, like, this whole area. So, no luck today in the world of the Tacoma graveyard. I guess his brother owns about half of it, and he wasn't here to sell us the hubs and stuff, but we'll be back. Big day of failures. We finally have a success. So, this truck here, we're gonna get the, the hubs, the knuckles and spindles, which I know there's different terms, but that's what I call them and then the uh, CV axles. All right, apprentice log here. So we're gonna come back on Sunday. He's actually gonna take the truck apart for me for free, which is really nice. And then hopefully it'll be finalized and everything and I'll update y'all on Sunday. Good morning, good morning, happy Sunday. We are headed back to Ricky's house and then back to the private yard to pick up the parts they should be pulled and we'll get paid, or I won't get paid. I will pay him for the parts and then we'll head back home. Got all the parts that we came here for. Had some issues with payment at first because I can't type in a phone number correctly. He got the money, and now I'm just gonna pull apart, pull, pull around to load up the parts. All loaded up. Hi, baby back at Ricky's house. He's helping me change my sway bar links. Uh, they cracked. One of them did because off -roading. One old sway bar link off. Now time for a new one. Well this was the problem is that this nut you can see somehow got smoothed down right here probably for my big tires and so that's what made it really hard to get off. This is a normal one and that is a smoothed down one. Like, that's as far as it goes. Oh. Like, oh. With the magnet. On to the left side. We are off the sway bar swap. Not sway bar, sway bar link swap. Uh, got rid of the old ones, upgraded them to Moog suspension, which I've heard mixed things about, but I the best way to get an opinion about something is to do it yourself, so. I'm gonna try them out. If these give out super early, then I'm gonna upgrade to the 555 brand, which is supposed to be like closest to OEM. Got them from Amazon, so we are on the road and we'll be home soon. All right, party people, just got home. Gonna unpack everything. This week, I'm gonna start ripping those hubs apart. I already bought the replacement seals and gaskets and stuff. And I'm gonna clean them up and I'm probably gonna paint them black and red. So stay tuned, hope you guys enjoyed this video. God bless, we'll see you guys next time. There's horses.